This is Stephen, and we're dealing with the word epitome, which is a person or thing that is a perfect example of a particular quality or type. So the epitome of something is the shining example or best example of something. The answer to this question is A, embodiment, which means a tangible form of an idea, quality, or feeling, meaning that it's the same thing as epitome, where you would say that this individual embodies or is the embodiment of an entire culture or this painting or something like that. So let's take a quick look at our other answer choices. Equilibrium, which means a state of physical or mental balance. So equal, a lot of equality going on here. So everything is an equal balance. Then we have C, resilience, which means capacity to recover quickly from difficulties. So that and equilibrium, that just doesn't really, that's not a shining example of something. And then viewpoint meaning way of considering or one's position on a matter a viewpoint could be the embodiment of something else but it is not an embodiment or does not mean embodiment or the epitome of something so a viewpoint might be the epitome but it is not what epitome means so none of these things work uh, as answer choices so if you take a look at parts of epitome epi meaning into and then tome even though it's a tomi so epitome um, it's kind of based off a couple of different words but like temnain which means to cut or put into sections but a tome you also know as a a single volume in a collection of works or it's like a tome is a book or is a is a part of something of a larger whole but epitome or tome or temnain basically meant to mean representative of something over time. So into a section or into something. So putting into this one person all of something else is how you can kind of think of it. Um, but the answer choice for epitome is A, embodiment.